You are a creative genius. Everyone has within them the essence of the creator. That which created the universe is alive as you, as an individual. And I realized it's impossible for us to fully actualize or even really partially actualize the power of our creative genius if we're constantly consuming other people's content. So, you know, this comes down to even simple things like listening to music at the gym, listening to YouTube videos on a walk. It's like, it, it takes our brain and puts it into this consumer mode and takes it out of creator mode. And so this doesn't just affect our ability to create in that given moment where we're consuming, it also creates this long tail effect of kind of creative numbness, where we don't know what it's like to sit in the stillness of who we are and allow creative forces to flow out from that ether of stillness within us. So I just wanted to share that realization because I was walking across the street today after going to the gym and I had my headphones in at the gym and I just realized like, oh, I'm not fully able to connect to the activities that my body's doing right now because I have this other focus, it's in my ears. Even having the like the noise cancellation on, on the AirPods, it just felt like I'm disconnected from myself. So that's the main thing I just wanted to share is I can feel how I can create so much more powerful creative projects and explosions of productive creativity in my life if I just give myself more time to do life without input. Let life be this, this space of connection to our own inner stillness. And then we can flow through life and bring creativity out into the field rather than sucking it f from the field into our minds 24 seven. So this is not something I'm particularly good at yet to be completely transparent. I just had this realization really black and white today. And so I wanted to share it, uh, but I'm by no means an expert at this yet. Um, I feel like I'm the kind of guy where whenever I'm alone for extended periods of time, I want to fill that void with a sense of like social togetherness. And it's easy to get that from a podcast or from a YouTube video, um, even from scrolling TikTok or something like that. But what I notice is that just it, it creates this short term numbness that feels good and kind of satiates that short term need for connection. But in the span of looking back at my days, I, I often feel very unfulfilled because I just squandered all of my creative energy on consuming content. So that's the essence of what I want to share today is I can really feel how your creative genius and my creative genius, it needs space without consumption of any kind of external stimulus, like content, for example, like nature and stuff is great. Consuming that is great. Uh, going on a walk, even in a city, just with no headphones, just tuning into yourself can also be good. Um, but yeah, we need that blank slate space to start to allow creativity to emerge. And I think that's really, really, really important and without that, I think we will die feeling unfulfilled, frankly. I think the people who feel unfulfilled at the end of their life, it's largely because they spent more time consuming than creating. So I'll leave that there. <laughs>